channel so today as you can tell by the title i'm going to be doing like a quick makeup tutorial makeup routine it's going to be like quick and you guys are going to be doing it with me because i don't even wear makeup every day but like it's quarantine so like why not like let me just play around in makeup and i'm going to record it for you guys so yeah so the first thing i do is like dampen my beauty button So I'm gonna be putting this on. It's a primer from NYX. It's called Angel Veil. Vale. And if you're gonna be like wearing heavy like eyeshadow, you wanna put it on your eyelids, but I'm not, but I'm gonna still put it anyway. And just smooth it out. So the sad thing, the second thing I'm gonna be doing is putting on my foundation, and this is in the color 360 Mocha from Maybelline. Maybe. Because maybe it's Maybelline, but it is Maybelline. And I'm gonna put it, shake it. I need to get more. I'm gonna shake it, shake it. And since this is like a daily makeup routine, you don't wanna put a lot, you don't wanna look cakey, so. And you can like start like blending it out if you think like you're putting too much. So that's what I'm gonna do because I don't wanna put too much. And this is how I can blend this out. I know some people use brushes, but I use the beauty blender because I just feel like it's better and like it blends my skin more. I have a small brush that I usually like go over my foundation like after I put the beauty blender on I might do that I don't know yet so then I'm gonna do my eyebrows I have this eyebrow pencils they're both from Colourpop. I love Colourpop so much. It's a very affordable brand, especially if you like starting out with makeup. And I've been using them since like high school. So they're really good. This is in the color soft black. Okay, so I'm gonna use this to like this buoy side. And just kind of shade my eyebrows. My eyebrows are really bushy right now because like I haven't got them waxed or anything because we're in the house. So don't judge me. Color it and then you just take it out like that. It's foundation on my hand, so yeah. I don't want to shade it in too much because I feel like my eyebrows are already bushy. I just have to like shape them. I'm using my mirror, like I said. y'all don't judge me but i'm actually in class right now and i can hear like the professor speaking in the laptop so i'm gonna go check on that i'm good i'm in math class and the professor is just going over like a worksheet but he already sent it to us so yeah and before I started this video, I used this NYX Pump It Up Plumper. 
it's good it's like supposed to like make your lips more bigger and like plump so when you so at the end when you put on what you want to put on your lipstick or your lip gloss it's like oh your lips blah, 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 you know i have my concealer this is in the color beautiful bronze So my class just ended, which is good. So you just can just conceal it and this brush it's from BH Cosmetics. BH Cosmetics. It's like a whole brush set. BH Cosmetics is also very affordable for beginners. I don't have like um lighter concealer like I usually have like a darker one and a lighter one but I ran out of the lighter one so I'm just gonna use the dark one to shape my eyebrow So I did the, the bottom of that one, I'm gonna do the top now. I would usually use the light, a lighter concealer, like a like a shade or two lighter than my skin color for the top, but like I said, I don't have any more. So you see how that I shaded, like I shaped the bottom and the top, and you can take your brush and just go down or just blend it out. But I like to use my fingers to be honest. So these are my eyebrows. I feel like they look nice. They look nice to me. So now I'm just gonna do like some contouring of my face. So going in with the same concealer, I'm going to put it underneath my eyes a little bit. I don't put too much because it's not really like it's only so the powder. The um, setting powder can like set on it because that one's like really brightens and highlights um, like my eyes and my cheeks because I feel like because I'm dark I don't have to do too much like highlighting so I just go in with that not a lot just like that I'm gonna take like this foundation stick for like my contour. It's gonna be like the darkest part of my face. So now I have concealer, contour, not a lot. Put some on my head. Cause I have a big head kind of. And this angled brush that is also for my beach cosmetics, I'm gonna just blend out the foundation. And this other brush from Beach Cosmetics as well. It's for a concealer. Just to like blend it out. I'm gonna put powder over all of it, so it's okay that it looks like this. So first I'm gonna set my concealer. I 
Oh, and this is translucent face powder. I'm gonna show you the package. This is from Laura Mercier. This translucent face powder in deep. They have two of them. The lighter one and the darker one. At first I got the lighter one and that didn't work because I'm dark. So I got the darker one, which is like really good. So I'm gonna use it to put it everywhere I put concealer on my face. Well, that's the baking. This is also from BH Cosmetics Studio Pro, and I'm gonna use these colors in the end. This one, this one, and this one. Lightly. You don't wanna have like a deep contour because that's ugly. These two dark colors, this is like a dark color and this is like a rosy dark and this kind of like, kind of blends it out so your face is not too dark but it's like the right color for me. Sometimes I contour my nose, but I don't want to do that today. And now going in with the same setting powder brush, I'm going to dust off all the powder. much you want to make sure you blend good so your face doesn't look like really really strong And you could just like go over your face a little bit just to like set it because it's setting powder. Blend, just keep blending until you like it. So I'm gonna take my mascara. Maybelline the Rock Get Wrong Mix Rise and I got it from the beauty supply store. Most of the products I use I ordered online from BH Cosmetics is online. The brushes and the palette. And then this setting pot I got from Sephora. And like other makeup stuff that I didn't use. And from NYX and ColourPop. From online. This one. And I'm gonna take off the lip gloss from NYX. I'm putting on like regular lip gloss. I don't wear lipstick, so yeah. This is fine for me.
This is one of my favorite lip gloss. It smells really good. Then I have my highlighter from ColourPop. It's called K-Pop Glow Up. And then this is my other brush from BH Cosmetics for my highlighter. lightly not too much then I like to take some and put it in my lip Last but not least, I take my setting spray, and this I got from, I want to say NYX, was it NYX? Yeah, I think NYX. It's called Pro Fix Oil Control Fixing Spray, and I have very oily skin, so this is good for me. So that was it for my daily makeup routine. Hope you guys like it. And if you guys are not subscribed yet, make sure you guys subscribe, like, and comment. Just love you guys.